everybody and welcome back to the channel this is the 4th of July okay um, I know I've already covered this topic but I wanted to hit it from this angle I saw this image circulating the internet and what came to mind when I saw it and I saw the caption that says same slave mentality different chains the scripture came to mind that says my people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge now, they're destroyed because they have no knowledge of certain things in the world. And they also reject knowledge. You come and tell them that this wasn't our day, that we need to, you know, sit this one out. What they do is they slap on a, a flag, outfit, t-shirts, shorts, the whole nine, jackets, caps, handkerchiefs around the head, bandanas or whatever you want to call them, socks shoes to match this is what we do saint patty's day we dress up the same way it's like we love everything presented to us by the oppressors to be honest with you it's unbelievable to me that they would spend one dime for the stuff you see them wearing right now and for those of you who say, oh, Deborah, stop being so serious all the time. It's not that serious. Oh, yes, it is. See, that's the problem. We don't take things serious enough. And we think everything is about this. Hey, all eyes on me. Look at what I'm wearing. I'm wearing the flag. My people are destroyed for the lack of knowledge. Do you even know what the, fr the flag represents? It amazes me that in this day and age, some of our people don't care. You can tell them, spell it out in black and white. Hey, this is what it represents. They don't care. That's not what it means to me. You can't just change the meaning and just take on the things of your oppressor and make it yours. The red stripes represent the blood of our ancestors. This is a symbol of their freedom, not yours. So yes, we're going to keep on talking about this stuff. Because our people parade themselves around like clowns in the streets. And I bet these people, when they know what all their stuff represents and they see our people sporting it like this, wearing it, I bet in their minds they say, those silly knee grows. What are they doing? If they only knew. At some point, we've got to grow up, people. And have some type of sense about ourselves to where this kind of stuff would not go down. The Bible actually told us that we would be the laughing stock of the world. It didn't say it in those words. But it pretty much said that we would be a proverb and a byword and that we would be hated of all nations. But some of our folk just don't get it. We're still trying to fit in with a group of people that was prophesied to hate us, can't stand us. But we want to dress up just like we want to conform to them when we were clearly instructed to be not conformed to this world, but to be transformed by the renewing of our minds but that's too much like right. That part, you don't want to do. You don't want your mind renewed. You want to keep that slave chain around your neck and around your head. You want your mind to stay wrapped up, tied up, and tangled up in the relics of this present world. Anyway, I didn't want to spend a whole lot of time on this. I just wanted to share with you this image that's circulating today because you know what day it is. Today is the 4th of July. And I wanted to share this with you guys because our people are destroyed. We're trying to reach them though. We're not making fun of them, y'all. We're trying to reach them. We're trying to show them. The Bible says, cry aloud and spare not. Lift up your voices like trumpets in Zion and show my people their transgressions. 
We have to show our people that they cannot continue to conform to this world, but that they have got to be transformed by the renewing of their minds. They've got to be. You got to let this stuff go, family. It's not so serious to where we have to grab hold and latch on to everything that they hand us. But that's exactly what we do. Anyway, I'm done with this video. Chop it up in the comment section. As always, keep it tight and keep it right. But until the next live or the next video, stay prayed up. We hope you liked today's topic. Please leave your comments below. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel, share it like this video, and with that, we're out. Be sure to ring the bell to be notified of new uploads on this channel, and also comment, share, like, and subscribe.